Hello lovely YouTube family and in this video we're going to be diving in the tutorial on how to recover your hacked WhatsApp account. I totally understand that the fact of you clicking on this video is because you've either been hacked or family or friend of yours WhatsApp account has been hacked. But the first thing I want you to do is please do not panic. Take it calm and easy because you can always recover your WhatsApp account. And then how exactly do you even know you've been hacked? It all starts with you using WhatsApp and all of a sudden you find out that you're being logged out of your account. And in few minutes or few hours to come, you start to get normal messages or calls from family or friend of yours asking you what exactly is wrong and then giving you feedbacks that you know you never requested. Now, how exactly do you even get hacked? The first and most common method is by you sharing your six digit verification code, probably as a result of being under stress or the person telling you something that you find scary or something that you feel is actually right. And as a result, once the person calls you, you send it out. Or it can also be by you clicking on fake links that look like WhatsApp, but they are basically scams. This is actually another random way a whole lot of people get scammed. And then the most ways that are not really common are the ways through the SIM swap, that is, the hacker tries to convince the carrier of your SIM to transfer your line, or the person actually creates a fake WhatsApp app and then you download that app and start to use it instead of the original WhatsApp. And the first thing you need to do in order for you to recover your account is to confirm that yes, you've actually been hacked. And the most usual way of you confirming this is by using the normal WhatsApp application and all of a sudden you've been logged out. And after a few minutes or few hours to come, you start to get unexpected messages from family, friends of yours, asking you what exactly is wrong, based on requests you know you never made. Now, the second step you need to do is by logging them out completely. And to do this, you need to ensure you do not delete or uninstall the WhatsApp application immediately you notice you've been hacked. But please note, in case you actually still delete it and install it back, it's still fine. The only effect or the only downside of doing this is the fact that you would be giving the hacker more time to make more settings on your account. But in case you don't delete it, you're cutting the time the hacker has in order for him to set more security on your account. Now, either way, what you need to do is to log back inside your WhatsApp account directly from the home page. So you want to click on the proceed and then you want to insert your phone number again. Once you insert your phone number, request for your normal six digit code via SMS or a call. The good scenario is if WhatsApp actually sends you this code, all you have to do immediately is to insert the code and then automatically you'll be logged back. And then you just want to go to settings and set your two-step verification. Now, the worst scenario, which is actually what a whole lot of people out there do go through, is the fact that you're requesting for this code, but you're not getting the code, either through a call or a text. The first thing you want to do is to ensure you have a good and strong network from your carrier. You need to ensure that wherever you are, the network there is strong. Now, in case your network is strong, but you're still not getting the code, what you want to do is you want to try it on in on airplane mode on your mobile device, wait for about four to five minutes, and then turn it off. Then you can proceed to request again. A whole lot of people after doing this do get their code. But what scenario? You still did this, but you're not still getting your code. Then you want to try clearing your WhatsApp storage or cache and wait for about 20 minutes but in case your device cannot clear the storage it's still fine all you can simply do is just wait for certain minutes for about 30 to 1 hour and then try again in most scenarios there are a whole lot of people out there that just wait for a certain period of time and then they try again and finally start to get the code now 
in case you actually try to log in that is you finally get the code and then you're being asked for a pin that you know you don't have an idea on a good example is the two-step verification code there are a whole lot of people that finally get the code that is the six digits code and then in the next step you see that you have been requested to insert a two-step verification code that you know you never set now this means the hacker had enough time and has finally secured your account in this scenario you need to actually wait for a minimum of about seven days this is actually something that whatsapp does automatically they reset the account after seven days but guess what the good news is it doesn't necessarily have to be up to seven days before you can actually reset the account and the fastest way for you to do this is by sending a mail direct to support at whatsapp.com now in this mail you want to insert the subject as account hacked and then in the body you want to insert please my account has been hacked help me recover now after inserting this particular body beneath it you're going to insert your full number including your international format an example here is plus 234 which is for nigerians and then you want to insert your name once you send this message you're going to get the normal automatic message which is the normal automatic reply and then after setting minutes or setting hours you're going to get the normal human reply they're going to help you reset your account and the next time you try to log in after inserting your six digit code you would have no reason to insert the two-step verification now once you're finally inside your account, the first thing you need to do is to go to settings on the account and you want to set your two-step verification. In case you're watching this video right now and you do not have your two-step verification set, do that right now to secure your account. But now in case you actually recover the account, you also want to head to two-step verification and set your pin and also add a recovery email please do not forget to add this email now finally once you actually logged in and you've set your two-step verification you also need to confirm that there is no device that is still using your account do you know that it's possible for you to be using your WhatsApp account and a whole lot of people can be spying on you because they've actually linked their device with your account? Now, this is something you also need to watch out for. And for you to actually know what exactly is happening, you want to go to settings and you want to head to linked account. Now, in this linked account, if you see any accounts that you do not know, kindly log it out immediately keep only devices you recognize that is your phone pc and whatever device you know you use for your water and now finally now your account has been hacked or it wasn't even hacked but then you lost your sim now the fastest thing you can do here is by reaching out to your sim provider you want to go to a nearby shop of your career and then you want to request for a sim swap now, a SIM swap is simply your network provider taking your number and inserting it on a new SIM. So, you can actually proceed with your number. And finally, in case you're still having issues with all the steps I've actually mentioned in this video, kindly send me a message through a DM or drop down comment in the comment section. I'm going to try my best to support you no matter what. I know a whole lot of people do reach out to me and I've been able to help a whole lot of people recover their hacked WhatsApp account and other social media account. So kindly reach out to me. I'll try my possible best to help you. And please do not forget to subscribe if you're new here or you haven't subscribed. Kindly subscribe, drop a like on the video and also feel free to share this video with your friends and family out there so as to protect whole lot of people and i'll see you guys in my next highly highly informative video thanks for watching